um, and vlog that for you guys so you guys can see the difference on the stocks versus the MRR wheels. And y'all can see the difference in having 305s in the rear and 265s in the rear. So with that being said, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and turn this camera off, clean up my hands and whatnot, move Vader um, out the way, move the missus' car in the garage, and then have Vader back in the driveway because I do got work in about an hour. So with that being said, y'all, I'll see y'all in a couple minutes. Five minutes later. Oh my God. Bro, that's the train. Oh my God. Yeah, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it. We ain't with the sub and in the car with it. Please, none of the talks, I heard enough of it. Like, what you gonna do? Where you at? Who you with? You ain't really about this. Don't talk about it. Really on the move, on the map, never slip. Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it. Real eyes, real lies, real lies. All the time, stand on it. If we said it, we don't walk around it. Loose lips, ink ships, red cup, blue strips, new phone, who this? No, we don't allow it. Really on go, I don't know what's an off day. Now we on road, came from. Alright, what is up, y'all? This is not a video that I've been. that I thought I would ever make, but here we are again. <sighs> so. I'm driving to work, and as y'all can hear, I, I I have a clip on my my phone, so I'll play the clip on my phone. Bro, I don't know what's going on right now. Oil pressure, everything's oil pressure, everything's good. No check engine light. But, but some, something's not right. Something, something is not right. Oh my God. Bro, that's the train. Oh my God. Oh my God, bro. Oh. Are you kidding me? Bro, what? But literally anything over like 35 miles per hour, there's a disgusting clunk that comes from the transmission. Literally, like disgusting. You hear it? Like that's 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 coming from the transmission tunnel. I don't know if the camera's gonna pick it up, but I'm pretty sure my iPhone picked it up. I just called Blake over at Crossroads. He says he's gonna give me a call back. We're gonna see how we go about this. But this is just crazy, man. This is this is crazy. <laughs> this is just, this is crazy, bro. The next day. Yo, what is good, y'all? You did what I'm saying. So it's been like two days since the last clip that you guys saw vader is right here um it's actually been stationary at my job for the past two days just because of the noise that you guys heard in earlier clips um i'm not 100 percent sure if the transmission is all the way gone just because i did some troubleshooting on my own um yesterday i took it around the block in manual mode because if you guys have been on the channel for a while then you guys know i've had a transmission issue on literally every single car after hazel so mamba same thing reaper same thing and now here we are with vader same thing a couple weeks go by transmission go gives out I don't understand it i don't know what's going on i literally have put 3,000 miles on the car and we're here so with that being said, y'all, let's go ahead and talk about it real quick. So I went ahead and I took the car around the block in manual mode because in automatic mode, obviously, you know what I'm saying, it was making all that noise and whatnot. Now, when I took it around the block in manual mode, second, third, and fourth are the only three gears out of all ten that the car is clunking in. So I assumed that you know what I'm saying? It would have to do with the clutch pack that controls those three gears. But my boy Frankie, he works at Mack Hawk Chevrolet, which is actually where the car is going. Thankfully, you know what I'm saying? The car 
has the factory warranty and I have a lifetime warranty on the powertrain so either way it goes it's covered um but yeah man it's going to go to a Mack Hike Chevrolet over there with my boy Frankie on Monday uh, he's going to take it apart and you know what I'm saying see what the transmission is looking like in there what's going on because it feels as though like something is just like loose or broke inside of the transmission housing itself because I remember on Mamba when the transmission went out on that car I would come to a stop and the car would still be downshifting like the the shifts were delayed and then with this car the shifts are still on point they still come when they're supposed to there's no delayed downshift so with that being said I'm not 100% sure if the transmission is all the way gone if it could be the torque converter or whatever it could be you know what I'm saying but it's obviously something mechanical nothing electronic because there's no lights on the dash the car did not throw any codes at all no hidden codes where it's like a soft code so it doesn't throw the check engine light but it does throw a code there's none of those I just I don't know I, I, I honestly am at a loss for words thankfully my boy Frankie is gonna be the one that does the work on it so I will be able to give you guys updates and stuff like that now the bad thing about all of this is you know what I'm saying the world is still coming back from the pandemic mm -hmm. also there's a war going on right now so it's like everything as far as getting parts and stuff like that is hella delayed so with that being said if the dealership doesn't have the parts on hand that they need to fix my transmission <sighs> Vader could be gone for a couple months you know what I'm saying just waiting for parts to come in alone so fingers crossed you know what I'm saying it's something very simple and they have the part in stock and my boy Frankie can tear it apart put the part in put it back together restart reinstall it in the car and I can have it back in like two weeks that'll be dope that would be very ideal but <laughs> at the end of the day it is what it is this is what comes with the car game man like like I always tell y'all bro something is gonna go wrong it's it's inevitable it's a man-made machine so you can't get upset or give up or want to quit or you know what I'm saying stump around or whatever whenever something goes wrong at the end of the day this is what I do give yourself five minutes five minutes you can cry you can scream you can yell you can cuss you can do whatever you want to do in reaction to whatever the situation that you're currently in is after those five minutes drop it you know what I'm saying and start focusing your energy on moving forward building a game plan setting up some some form of you know what we're gonna do next versus you know putting all your energy into being mad or feeling sorry for yourself you know what I'm saying strategize and just fix it and keep it pushing I gotta be telling everybody man you just gotta charge it to the game and keep on pushing this is literally the third car that I've bought that has had a transmission issue literally within a month as y'all can see still got paper tags back there so I, <laughs> you know what i'm saying i'm definitely a living testament of the fact that you know what i'm saying it it is what it is you just gotta keep on pushing keep on going never give up so with that being said y'all that's the update that's where we are right now if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button for your boy turn on those post notifications i'm gonna keep you guys in the loop with everything got one of those little a hey, okay but anyway i'm gonna keep you guys in the loop with everything um as soon as i get an update you guys will get an update and we'll just go from there man hopefully vader's not gone for too long now vader's down y'all can we get a can we get a rip in the chat you know what i'm saying to my transmission <laughs> but that being said y'all hit that subscribe button give this video a big thumbs up drop a comment in the comment section down below i'll see y'all in the next one peace